We are celebrating the intersection of chess and music in our newest exhibition, Sound Moves, where music meets chess, here at the World Chess Hall of Fame. This exhibition was co-curated by me and Bradley Bailey, a professor at St. Louis University. This exhibition is very near and dear to our hearts because not only do we celebrate chess and culture here, but we also have a robust music program that started in the first weeks of us opening in 2011. It's not surprising that in some places chess and music intersect. One thing that we love about chess here is that it encompasses all cultures, all languages, all periods of history, and it's really good at storytelling and the exact same thing can be said for music. And so it was so easy to see where these intersected. In the show, we represent how certain chess players were also very prolific musicians, how some of the biggest bands and important music writers were obsessed with chess. And so it's really fun to see some of these celebrities. We've got photos of RZA and the Wu-Tang Clan, the Kid Leroy, Bad Religion, everybody playing chess. Sometimes they're playing behind stage and sometimes it just means so much to them that they use both of these, the chess players and the musicians, as a way to kind of escape. We have something for everybody in this exhibition, from a copy of 13th century manuscripts to number 12 by the artist Guido van der Verve. This is an actual chess piano that makes piano sounds when you press on the keys, which are actually the squares on the chessboard. Also, we have music videos and costumes worn in those music videos from the chess player and musician Huga de Prima. This particular ensemble, the headpiece and shoulder piece, were designed by Diego Montoya, who is known for his incredible work in RuPaul's Drag Race. And also we have musical instruments, this incredible bassoon, which was owned by Jacqueline Piatigorsky, who's in the U.S. Chess Hall of Fame, and her family has donated so many incredible objects to our collection. As you can see, we have so many different objects and experiences here where you can see the true connection between music and chess. Throughout the course of the exhibit, we're gonna to have tons of programming for you to come enjoy. And another fun thing is that we're partnering with the Muni this summer. They're showing Chess the Musical from July 5th through the 11th. You can see this wonderful exhibit through January 28th, 2024. To learn about it and our other exhibitions and programming, visit our website at www.worldchesshof.org.